Hi, welcome to your channel, Generous, Gracious and Gallant. I'm your host, Mohar, and I'm back today with another very inspirational tale for all of you. The inspirational Indian, a social activist whose story I've brought for you today is Veswada Wilson, an Indian social activist, founder and national conveyor, Safai Karamchari Andolan, which is a human rights organization whose goal is the eradication of manual scavenging. His efforts in 1993 resulted in employment of manual scavenging being made illegal. He was awarded the Raman Magsaysay Award in 2016. A very inspirational Indian. I'll be sharing more with you about him on the video shortly. However, before that, I wanted to share with you a request to kindly subscribe to the channel Generous, Gracious and Gallant. Press the bell icon so that you get an update on every new video which I bring for you on this channel. And also share these videos with your friends and family. So encourage them to subscribe to the channel. Coming back to our inspirational Indian, Beswada Wilson. Was born in 1966 in the Kolar gold fields in Karnataka in South India. His father was a Safai Karamchari or a manual scavenger manually removing excreta from dry toilets in the Kolar gold fields. His elder brother too was a manual scavenger who worked with the Indian railways and then with the Kolar gold fields. Wilson did his intermediate from Hyderabad and then graduated in political science from Dr. B. R. Ambedkar Open University in Hyderabad. 1986, he took up his fight against manual scavenging. His family and close relatives opposed his highlighting this fact. Too many people were even ashamed to speak about their profession of manual scavenging and to admit its existence. But Bezwada Wilson began breaking the silence. He began a letter writing campaign to the local authorities the KGF authorities, the corporators, the ministers, this, he wrote to the CM, the Prime Minister and to multiple newspapers. This brought forth results. 1993, the Indian Parliament enacted a law and banned construction of dry toilets and made employment of manual scavenging illegal. Despite the above ban, many dry latrines continued to be constructed and manual scavenging continued. Seeing this, Bezwada Wilson created a platform campaign against manual scavenging CAMS to ensure conversion of dry latrines to flush toilets and rehabilitation of manual scavenging workers. 1994, he co-founded the Safai Karamchari Andolan SKA and launched it at a national level. The goal was to totally eradicate dry toilets and rehabilitation of the manual scavengers at the national level. 2003, Bezwada Wilson along with other social organizations and SKA filed a PIL in the Supreme Court naming all states and multiple government departments such as the railways, the defense, the judiciary and education department as violators of the law and continuing to employ manual scavengers. 2007, finding the struggle too slow and the legal process too cumbersome, Bezwada met with MPs, ministers and national advising members 
and went on requesting them to ensure that manual scavenging is banned. The result of his efforts, it became one of the major aspects of the 12th five-year plan in India in 2010. 2009, he got elected as a Ashoka Senior Fellow for Human Rights. He continues to put in his efforts to end the shameful practice of manual scavenging across the country. 2016, he got the Raman Maxese Award for his efforts in removing manual scavenging across the country. Friends, I am sure you find these videos which I bring for you on your channel very, very inspirational. Please do subscribe to the channel and also share these videos with your friends and family so that they too are encouraged to join the channel Generous, Gracious and Gallant. I will be back very soon with another very inspirational video on your favorite channel Generous, Gracious and Gallant. Till then, good luck, all the best, stay safe.